When Bill and Hillary Clinton left the White House in 2001, their financial standing looked grim. During a tense interview with NBC News in 2018, the former president claimed he didn't get out of the Monica Lewinsky scandal without some hefty legal costs, saying, quote, I left the White House $16 million in debt. I felt terrible then. Hillary also said the couple were supposedly slumming it back then when Diane Sawyer asked her to defend the $5 million she made giving speeches. We came out of the White House not only dead broke, but in debt. Flash forward to 2016, and not only were the Clintons completely debt-free, the power couple were sitting on a whopping estimated $240 million in earnings, according to Forbes. So how did they go from clipping coupons to almost a quarter billion dollars in just 15 years? By doing what the Clintons do best, writing books and giving speeches. And a cool $189 million of that came courtesy of Bill. Immediately after his presidency, Bill Clinton earned $125,000 for a speech at Morgan Stanley. This kicked off the Bill Clinton tour that included hundreds of stops that earned him $106 million in 15 years. His 2004 memoir, My Life, became a national bestseller. And three books later, Clinton pocketed roughly $38 million just from his work as an author from 2001 to 2015. He then earned a combined $39 million by advising American billionaire businessman Ron Burkle and doing consulting work for two for-profit education companies. Hillary didn't bring in much between 2001 and 2013, since she was a senator for New York and the Secretary of State during those years. But in the two years immediately following her exit from the Senate, Hillary raked in $9 million for speaking fees. I will be the youngest woman president in the history of the United States. In 2015, while she was making her second run for president, Hillary earned a million bucks from speaking alone. And in 2014, she was awarded the fifth richest book deal of all time for her second memoir, Hard Choices. Following the 2016 presidential election and her loss to Donald Trump, Hillary had a lot to say, and she knew America wanted to hear it. In typical Clinton fashion, she put pen to paper and crafted what happened, detailing her presidential bid from a first-person perspective. I don't think I'm held to the same standard as anybody else. Following the release of the book, which debuted at number one on the New York Times bestseller list, Clinton embarked on the Hillary Clinton Live book tour, where the truth didn't come cheap. According to Fox News, Clinton was charging a whopping $2,375 for a VIP platinum ticket on some of the tour stops, which included, quote, two front row seats, a photo with Clinton backstage, and a signed book. There's no word on how much Clinton earned from this book deal with Simon & Schuster, though Forbes reports that it was more than likely a massive sum. Not to be outdone by mom and dad, Chelsea Clinton is a millionaire in her own right. I am not running for public office. The sole Clinton child is estimated to be worth about $15 million, according to Celebrity Net Worth. Straight out of graduate school at Oxford University, Clinton started earning the big bucks when she landed a job with consulting firm McKinsey & Company, as reported by The Telegraph. And according to The Observer, Clinton was raking in about $120,000 a year at the company when she started out. After three years with McKinsey, Clinton set her sights on the hedge fund world. She began working for Avenue Capital Group in 2006, where, according to New York Magazine, she was probably making about $100,000 a year. In 2011, the first daughter expanded her horizons when she accepted a position as an NBC correspondent, a gig for which she was reportedly earning $600,000. During her part-time gig, Clinton appeared on several episodes of Rock Center with Brian Williams and Nightly News before ultimately calling it quits in 2014. Of course, Chelsea has also put out a few books over the last few years, including one she wrote with her mom. I'm really excited about my new book. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.